So it's been a while but I'm back with fourth episode of AI tutorials and in this episode we are going to see what is agent and what are the types of agent. So let's get started. So the term agent may be quite familiar with you guys and you probably think of this while hearing agent right. Agents are coming. Agent. Go. Well, it's actually not in this case. Anyway, in the previous video, we knew agent is something that acts or basically does some tax on behalf of some party or a person. It is as simple as that, but our education system wants more complicated and exact definition. So let's start with that. Well, agent is anything that can be viewed as perceiving its environment through sensors and acting upon the environment through actuators. So our agent must perceive the information from the environment through sensors and it should act upon that environment through the actuators. Feeling confused? Don't worry, we'll see the figure and some few examples so that it will be crystal clear for you guys. So let's see the figure first. So here we have the environment and agent. Our agent should have something called sensors and actuators. These actuators are also called affectors sometimes. Some of these terms can be new for you guys. So let's see what it is first. So first of all, let's see what is sensors. Sensors are something that detects the events and changes in the environment. Whereas actuators, sometimes also called affectors, are just the movable parts of the agent. Perception is the way in which something is understood or interpreted. Here the input are taken from different sensors. Now the percept is just the agent's perceptual inputs at a given instance. Now we know these terms, so let's head back to the figure. So in our figure, what it basically happens is our agent will get or perceive the information from environment through these sensors. And then our agent will process the information and make the decision. Now the actions are taken in the environment through actuators. In this way, our agent performs certain tasks. Now let's see the examples to be more clear. For the human agent, sensors can be ears, eyes and other organs from which information can be achieved from the environment, whereas actuators can be hands, leg and other body parts from which certain tasks can be performed. Similarly for a robotic agent, sensors can be cameras and infrared range finder, whereas actuators can be different movable motors. So now we know what is agent in artificial intelligence, so let's see the type of agent. There are four types of agents and they are not these four, okay? These are not the type of agent we are discussing here. Anyway. First one is simple reflex agent. Second one is model based agent. Third one is called goal based agent. And lastly, the fourth one is utility based agent. We'll see these four types of agent in detail in the next video. So I'll see you guys there.